Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Heroes of Mind Magic 4 The Gathering Storm. Today we are starting campaign number 3 called Another Bard's Tale. Agronel begins her quest to find Aif's artifacts on the Isle of the Dawn. Recently, shadowy forces have beset this normally peaceful region, though no one knows exactly why. Is it purely coincidence or part of a plot to prevent the artifact's recovery? Well, let's find out. A Grendel must locate Ave's Mandolin, an artifact of legendary power, as her part in the quest to stop Hexes. She begins her search in the Isle of the Dawn, a spot favored by Ave in her travels long ago, and the only place rumors of the Mandolin point to. We must search the Isle of the Dawn for the Mandolin, an artifact musical instrument of considerable power. This power from the Mandolin will be necessary to help defeating Hexes. Okay, so that's the same description. We need to capture Town of Twin Pines and we are limited to level 18. Isle of the Dawn is the name of the scenario. We will go to the advanced game as last time and let's begin. Day 1. My famous bard luck strikes again. Our captain tried to hurry me to Devonport through a mild looking storm, but the weather of these shores is trickier than he gave credit. His ship was tossed along the rocks and destroyed. My journal has survived and I will attempt to record the important parts of my journey here. I need to hurry to Devonport and meet up with Larinaf, a retired adventurer and now Devonport's governor, and tell him about my search. I will need his permission to search for and remove the mandolin from the Isle of the Dawn. Well, hello there, beauty. Born in a small woodland village, a Grenel lost both of her parents in an attack by a neighboring kingdom. She chose to become a bard both to honor her parents by keeping their memory alive through song and to record history from the perspective of the common people. She starts with advanced scouting and advanced stealth, meaning she is invisible to level 2 creatures. Uh, we'll be able to level this up very soon, very high, and also with basic nature magic and basic herbalism. I've read something about this scenario on the, on the internet, so I know there is a nice quest uh, where you can get basically all the scouting stuff. So we'll not be leveling up scouting, but we can totally level up um, the nature magic here. So let's get advanced nature magic and let's get also advanced herbalism. That sounds very good. And let's go and start picking up everything basically, right? Right, we have we have so many things to do here. And the quest uh, will require 20 of each resource from us. So what we'll be doing uh, first is just picking up everything uh, that we can. Uh, let's start over here maybe. And... Uh, there and flagging mines and things like that okay can I go here oh only through wow fine let's do it like this one gem then let's take the experience and we get uh, basic meditation sure take that take that Take money this time and uh, move even more. Okay, Apprentice's Handbook, nice. Some sulfur, some of that. And can we, oh wow, we need to go all the way around to flag this, okay. What do we have here? Wasp Swarm. Okay, what kind of spells do we have? Actually, we have all level 1 spells because of the notebook, which uh, comes really handy, I have to say. Pathfinding. No movement penalty. Yeah, we should totally try to do that. What's this? On during combat. Okay. Well, um, cast a spell, pathfinding, 
And let's go this way. How will I know if uh, if pathfinding wears off or not? Oh, look at the shield, by the way. And there's uh, a lot of guards there. Alliance Shield of Courage. I have not picked this up because we will be able to level up scouting a lot in just a moment. I have not picked this up either. Every week. Yeah, let's take it. Gold, okay. Uh, sulfur, nice. We still need more mines. I don't see any mines here. This is the quest. And we need to go this way. Alright. Let's end the turn. Which resources do we need the most? Probably the crystal. And there's st more stuff over here. Uh, I should have... Yeah, let's flag the crystal mine as well. And there's a lot of nice uh, sulfur over here. And uh, Griffon Hearts plate mail. Wow. Okay. Oh wait a moment. That's uh, that's not level two creatures, right? <laughs> okay. I will know better next time. So take this, take this, and uh, try to go away somehow. Is this gonna be enough? Let's uh, let's test it out. No, it's not gonna be enough. Ouch. Okay, so we do need to pay attention on this map. It's not like it's super duper easy. Maybe here. Let's see if that's enough. Yeah, it's enough. Day 8. Well, it will be trickier getting to Davenport than I thought. The way is guarded by a group of Thunderbirds. I need to find a way to sneak past them. I wonder if anyone here will assist me before I have Larinaf's official permission to search for the Mandolin. Rumors have started about a skeletal army to the northwest, threatening the Isle of the Dawn. I need to get to Davenport as soon as possible to find out what truth there is to these rumors. Well... We'll figure it out soon enough. Uh, expert nature or basic combat? Let's actually go also for basic combat before I change my mind. So now we have enough sulfur. Now we need a lot more crystal and some wood. So crystal and wood both are over here. So let's take those. And I see something nice over there. Let's, uh, let's save it as uh, this and see if we can get a level up here we can get expert nature magic yeah nice so we have expert nature magic and basic uh, combat that's cool maybe you can teach me something nice over here summon elf not bad uh, get the ore this was snake strike did i get it already well let's assume i have it oh there's a town okay and now we still need more crystal so i can either go down but i don't see any crystal unless there is crystal somewhere over here or i can exchange but i don't want to exchange too soon and we don't have enough anyway yeah we don't have enough Okay, let's come down here as well and uh, I think we'll need some oh wow okay one more let's take um, advanced combat please take the stuff of summoning some wood uh, more experience oh you're totally no, let's take the money. Uh, we will need money. I'm, I'm pretty sure about that. Okay. And now I think we should be able to go 
Whoa, whoa, whoa. I should be able to go... I flag that, actually. Um, now we need to go and exchange. Now let's flag it. Okay, there are no more resources. This is Davenport, I guess, because the Thunderbirds are guarding it. Okay, it will take some time until we can get there. Yeah. Quite unfortunate, especially with those guys around. Let's do it like this. And the turn. Day 15. I met a group of friendly peasants today. They seemed surprised that I wanted to head to Devonport. Apparently a curse has been placed on the city and the area around it, and the citizens have been fleeing the city to escape it. They suggested I talk to a retired thief that lives in the woods nearby to the southwest. They insisted he could help me pass the Thunderbirds blocking me from Devonport, though they bid me to stay away from the town for my own safety. I thanked them for their information, gave them a few gold coins for their time and moved on. I see. Well, let's see if they attack me or not. And try to exchange. We will need 20 each, so we have enough of that. And we have enough of... I don't know which one do we need for this kind of town. Let's say we have too many gems. Let's take like one there, 19, and we have a gem mine. I mean crystal mine, so this is enough. And we can go back, right? And we need to go right here. And next turn, now we have 20 each. And here we go. So as you can see, we have advanced scouting and advanced stealth. Let's see what they give us. Chesh, a retired thief too old to continue his roguish ways, offers to take you under his wings and teach you how to perfect your stealth techniques. His apprenticeship fee is 20 units each of sulfur, mercury, gems, crystal, wood and ore. Trade for Grandmaster Stealth? Yes. And we got uh, Grandmaster Stealth, Master Pathfinding, and Grandmaster Scouting, so this is like, wow. <laughs> okay, so now we need to level up maybe a little bit, 2000 experience. Yeah, sure, let's level up. Summon White Tiger. One more, and the last one over here. And we get uh, Expert Combat, Expert Herbalism. Let's get Expert Combat. I am sort of worried that they will see me. But let's try. They do not see me, okay. So now uh, we can go and take the town, but I also want to go and take these two now. I don't know, maybe... Maybe we can just wait with that. Nobody's gonna steal them from us, right? Um, a grenade will crush this army like a bug, okay. Isle of the Dawn journal update. Devonport stands before me defenseless. I see no trace of the garrison here and much of the population has fled outside the city. Fortunately, the structures remain fully intact. When I asked one of the few remaining citizens, he replied with stories of poison and plagues afflicting the town for the last few weeks and then pointed to the harsh desert outside without saying another word. When I asked about Governor Larinov, he mentioned that uh, the governor had itself to try and personally handle the problem. He's not been seen since. Well, that's... That's, uh, that's a bummer. We have captured Davenport. Okay. Get some spell points. Town is fully built up. What does Creature Portal do? 
summon a variety of things. We need the pyre, for which we need the creature portal, and a lot of uh, mercury, right? I guess we can do that. Conservatory of Chaos, oh, a level 4, Druids Hall only, can't get level 5. Chaos and life, probably not. Okay, let's build the creature portal then. It costs a lot too, but uh, I think we are supposed to are supposed to build it. Not absolutely sure. Yeah, let's get it. Oh, and this gives us those wasp words. Right, I totally forgot about that. I think we'll keep them like this, right? Because we can switch to the big bad mantises and we might hmm that's a good question nah I want to take the wasp wards they are funny little creatures and uh, now we can go and I'll either go back here get another level or we just uh, continue leveling up other stuff. Uh, I wanted to check the spells we get. Fortune, Giant Strength, Mass Speed, Summon Fire Elemental. That's not bad. Summon Unicorn and Summon Wasp Ward. Sure. A bit later. So we only need a Master, for which we need two more levels here. One more level here, one more level here, four levels. We should be able to get that. Yeah, we should be able to get that. Okay, so... What's this? Oh, Larinaf in a prison, right. Funny. Uh, let's uh, let's uh, make a good save. Next turn. And uh, what do we do next? Can I free him? Journal update. This morning before the sun's light became too harsh, I noticed a small structure past the dunes to the southwest. It appears to be guarded by Cerberi, though what infernal creatures like that are doing this close to Davenport is a mystery. The structure is large enough to be one of two things. A small storage area or a small prison. Perhaps that is where Lorina is. I guess so. Will they attack me? The guards have abandoned this prison, leaving the key to the door hanging on the hook just outside the reach of the captive, blah blah blah, and so on. And they do attack me, okay. So you are level 10, Larina. And we have... Um, fire Elementals. And Wasp Swarms. And you have Lightning. Ooh. Not bad. And you have maybe... Fire Elementals. Cool. <laughs> okay, I like it. Speed, summons, summons. You know what? Hide. And now you can maybe shoot or go melee or just go away. And you can use ranged. Yeah, you can. Good job. Good job. So, who are you? What do you do? Um, expert, 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 advanced, advanced, advanced. Huh. Hey, you're not so bad, lot enough. But. Um, 
I don't want you to steal the experience from my gull, so we'll split you up, okay? We'll split you up. And then... Um, maybe a Conservatory of Chaos for some better spells? But I do want the Pyre first, so 14,000, 16, 10 and 20. We need more of the other resource. So you will be picking stuff up. Larinov will grant me his permission for me to continue on my search if I will assist him in ridding the Isle of the Dawn from the undead forces in the northwest. Northwest, okay. He believes that the forces are in league with Hexes and he feels that in aiding each other we will aid ourselves. He has volunteered his personal assistance in tracking down Ave's mandolin and suggested that we might find clues in the towns to the east. To the east? There is nothing to the east. Need that. I don't know if I should go down or where. What does the imp pit give me? Nothing. I will need a little bit of sulfur. And go that way. And you go this way. Well, the town is basically fully built, so I don't need to do much else. Yeah. Let's wait. So only two mercury. And maybe some... Some of that. Okay, go here, and here, and here. Oh, plus five mercury. Would you believe that? And there's a town? I think so. Just one more day, and we still can't do it because we don't have enough gold. <laughs> That's nice. The desolation in this area seems contained to the area around Devonport. The main part of the isle appears normal. The towns that Larinov mentioned are west and northwest of here, so not east obviously, only a few days journey away. Hopefully we can reach there before the undead armies from the north do, and they should shed light on the resting place of the mandolin. I see. We also have... Uh, to fight dragons there, okay. Where do we want to go? I think I will go down. Over here. More mercury, perfect. Gems. Nice. Do you want to go somewhere? Can you go somewhere? You can. So now the only thing we need is a little bit of money. And we might be able to exchange. But um, no, let's not do that. We get a thousand per day. So that's not too much. But uh, maybe we can... They are level 3. They are probably level 3. So I can't steal from them. I mean, I could try. Can we try? And they don't even want to give me anything. Ah, uh, okay. Well, let's try to steal from them. Oh, come on! Money! Thank you. Jeez, that was, that was difficult, wasn't it? And there's a, there's a level up as well. So take this. Some wood. I can do that later. Come closer. Thank you. And uh, now we should be able to do that really. One day will not make a difference. Day 22. I noticed dark smoke this morning past the forest to the west. 
Verdigris, a mining town on the western shore of the Isle of the Dawn, was apparently destroyed by undead forces, or so tell the rumors. I definitely sense a peculiar chill in the air now, and chill uncommon in this region. I'm beginning to think these rumors are true, in the process of trying to get a better vantage point to identify exactly where the smoke was coming from in the west. I noticed that the southeast of the forest around Devonport is gone, replaced with a harsh desert. What sort of powerful magic could do such a thing? I don't know, I don't want to know. Let's do a pyre and continue stealing stuff, right? And also continue getting power-ups. Let's uh, save to get something sweet. So we have expert, advanced, basic. Okay, a lot of nature magic needs to be needs to be done. Uh, we don't have money, of course. Of course. Um, well, that sucks. Don't die. And we will go and take the town, maybe. Where's the where's more money? Here's some money. Maybe I should also flag the structure, but that's going far away from here. These guys will attack me, right? That's not where I want to go. I mean, I could kill them using our hero here, but he's also on the way away. Like, seriously? Come on, dudes. Hmm. Maybe I can... Maybe I can fight them. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. Oh, they didn't attack me. That's so strange. Okay, take that and this and we probably have enough for the town too. More magic, yeah, yeah, sounds like a good uh, option right here. So what we need is... Uh, Well, either shooters or... F well, let's summon the fire elementals, shall we? And let's summon a lot of them. How many hit points do we have? 50. These guys have 35, 7, 12. So I need about 20 at least not have any issues and uh, actually let's uh, since I don't have that much mana let's spend it all like this and with eight giant strength on them and now oh, we still have five you can do stone skin First you, then them. Uh, I, I have probably done too many. <laughs> but we'll be able to replenish our mana in the town, I hope. Okay, let's take uh, advanced meditation. Alright. Capture the town. It appears my famous luck has struck again. I have found the information I was looking for, but in the process I have learned I have a good deal more work in front of me than I thought. 
Ave's mandolin is definitely not located on this isle, as the rumors I had been following would have suggested. The mandolin was carefully hidden away, and the only two clues left for its whereabouts were an ancient suit of armor and a beautiful necklace. To get the mandolin, I will need to find the armor and the necklace. Unfortunately, we can find no information telling where they might be located. Well, that's a bummer. Right, uh, we need a mage guild so that we can replenish our mana. Summon wolf's pride and speed is okay. You can stay in the town, my dear. And this guy will continue picking up stuff. Summon air elemental will come in handy eventually. Uh, did I just kill you? I may have killed you. In here. We have all on the first, all on the second row. Conservatory of Chaos and Life is not needed, so this town is done. This town is done. Next. And now you can take that. And this. Gems. Nice. Do you want to? Dozens, dozens. I guess you could. Dozens, of course. Yeah, let's uh, let's uh, try to use this guy as well. I mean, why not? So, what can you do? Lightning on them first, and then on these guys. Yeah, that was close. I don't know if we can do another one. We'll see. Then you can... Sacred Grow. Yeah, we need more spell points. You have replenished your mana so go and uh, scout and actually we can also do scouting with uh, with these girls right they are they are fast and will help me find where I need to go the day we finally came within viewing distance of the remains of Vergerdris. Some smoke still rose from the town and the sound of carrion birds finishing their work was audible from a distance away. Something very powerful must have been hidden in this town to merit such utter destruction simply to find it. Though most of the homes are destroyed, it appears that the mines themselves might still function if we can rid the villages of the creatures picking through the rubble. I see. Oh wow. A lot of guys there, right? Okay, the second one can go down here, maybe. And tell me more about... There's a town. Okay, so we are going to go there, I guess. But first, this way. A temple, okay. There's dozens of them, okay. That's a lot. Have we been here? No, we haven't. I mean, we have, but we haven't haven't gotten anything from there. Let's let's take the town first, and maybe find the abandoned mines as well eventually. This town, yeah, this town will need a lot of love. Let's go down as well. Okay, is that all the, all the stuff? I think so. Since we have one more, let's send her. This way? 
Yeah, that's where we need to go. Alright. So first you. You can even, like, flag that. Um, yes, I want to fight them. I don't have anything to fight them with besides these guys. But I think they might be enough. Let's do two of them. Nice. Okay. I don't want that. I do want to go here. Anti-magic. I think that might be quite important. And the last unit over here must go around. That's fine. Next turn. Just uh, steal some stuff and go get the town. Yeah, we should be fine over here too. I do have it saved, so let's see. Okay, uh, these guys again. Defend, wait. Maybe that was not such a good idea, I should have just, just been shooting. Yeah, totally. And let's do one more. Don't uh, overdo it this time. Okay. We have found no information on Ives Mandolin here, but I found a passage in the book describing the resting place of an ancient suit of armor called the Harmonic Chainmail, once worn by an elven bardess. The best I can tell it would be in the vicinity of the mining town Verdigris. The book also mentioned a necklace worn by a bard called the Necklace of Muses, though to be located east of the Thunderflash Mountains on the mainland. The book suggests these items have a connection with the mandolin. I may need to find them as well. Okay. Let's do the Sacred Grove then. And um, continue with like all of this. Yeah, I want to... I want to finish up picking up stuff with everybody. So I have never witnessed devastation this close before today. The grisly sights were bad enough, but closing my eyes brought no solace. The sounds and smells were perhaps more revolting. Even the normally stoic Larinav appeared shaken by the callous disregard for life and property. Near the center of the town, a pit had been dug under the ruins of a building. It appears that a heavy container of some sort had been pulled out and dragged away to the north. Whoops. Okay, can't get there. That's alright. Uh, you have full HP right now or not? And again, I have forgotten... How much, oops, how much uh, time have we already spent recording? You don't have more mana, oops. Okay, that sucks. Come on, you have to survive this. Nice. Nice. Go there 
10 here. And then you will need to go to replenish your mana somewhere. Probably that other town or something. Okay. So... What should we do? I guess we need to build um, units everywhere. Let's make the same kind of units. Or maybe I should switch to Trito Blotch for some of the shooters. But we do have some shooters there. It doesn't matter really. I don't know if I will need to level up all these towns or not. But let's build city halls, if nothing else. Can't build anything there. Okay, so... That's one thing to pick up. We are not going to be able to go there. Or there. So maybe... Ah. Stay here, go a little bit more up. You can go and have a look over here. Okay, there's really nothing else. This guy can pick up some wood and continue this way. There's nothing else. And you can pick this one up. Uh. Well, go inside the town, I guess. Don't need all of you. Next turn. Here we go. So, some gems. And then she can have a look around you can have a look over here okay there's really nothing and this one can take that we don't need to fight them at all i think so go back yeah Level 10. We still have 8 levels to go. Sure. So what else can we get? This one. Nice. And... I don't know about them. They are probably capable of uh, going after me, aren't they? I, I honestly don't know. You need to go replenish your mana. And the last one... Hmm. Okay, go back. That looks good. So maybe more money over here, city hall, in this town, tiger den, don't have enough money, yeah, figures. But our income has increased to 3000 per day, which is good, right? This one has the city hall, yes. Next. Okay. How much for the next level? 1,800. Take the money. Wand of weakness, sure. Take the money. And gems. We have the anti-magic already. Need to go this way too. And you can go that way. And we continue scouting here. Mm. 
that's all we can do. Alright. Next. I don't know if we can do anything else. Probably not. <laughs> yeah, that's all we could do. So now we need to return for these. Maybe for some artifacts over here. We have visited that already, right? Visited, yes. Hmm. Green is us. Okay. What's this? Griffin's nest here. Oh. Probably should have done that, right? Most likely. Don't know why I didn't. Next turn? Actually. Maybe you can build at least a tiger den. Next. That's tempting. Take the money though. And what's this? We already have sure footed boot. We don't have this uh, sulfur mine, looks like it. Don't know why I didn't pick it up. Absolutely no idea. <laughs> okay, here we go. Go inside the town, spend the day there, build a tiger den, and uh, can you like have a quick look? Oh, there's uh, an army there. Can't see much. This way. One more. Come on. Okay. Nothing here. Bye. This one, this one actually can do something. So come closer. And closer. And you can have a look here. Gambler's deck. Okay. We can use that. Can use that. Now, Griffin Cliffs need a citadel, and citadel needs money. Oh. Unicorns need rainbow, and rainbow needs not that much. So maybe we can get unicorns. Because getting a citadel and then this one will cost like a lot. But the birds are pretty superior. Well, match with level 1 at least, if nothing else, so that we can, you know, replenish our mana there since you haven't replenished your mana. <laughs> ay ay ay, mistakes, mistakes. Okay then. What else is there to do? I do have decent army here, so I'll just go back, take the army, uh, take the experience and everything and I'll be on my way, right? So come here. I don't know how and from where did you get experience, but I probably shouldn't care too much about it. You go up. Did you not get your mana refreshed? Are you not in the town? You did get your mana refreshed, okay, sorry about that. Then uh, take this and that. And you can give me the deck. 
and go away. Okay, now we have only three units. That's good. I see something still here that we need to visit. And... Would that... I mean... The Griffins would be so much better, right? But that's like a lot more money. And I can't even... Uh, yeah, I shouldn't even waste money at all because I need money here, first of all. And I also need money to buy the birds. The other birds, the flaming birds. Expert meditation, yeah. So we have expert meditation, advanced herbalism and expert nature. We still need two more levels for master master um, nature magic. We already have grandmaster, grandmaster and grandmaster there soon. Expert combat can also be leveled up. Okay, in that case... Let's take the Summon Air Elemental. I think we didn't get it from, from here yet. You can get this and that. Nice. And you can probably just come and help us. Uh, or you can maybe defend the town. I'm not sure what to do with you. Go to sleep. Next. Summon Elemental. Uh, wow, 70% magic resistance. That sounds like a very good thing to get, doesn't it? But we can't. Okay. That's fine then. We should also try to get this Mercury and that. Yeah, I obviously don't know exactly what I'm doing. <laughs> Ouch. We'll get them later. Here. Okay, now this is really it. We have four birds. That should be more than enough, I think. It should be more than enough. Expert herbalism or master combat. Let's take expert herbalism. We'll take combat a bit later. Yeah. <sighs> it's a tough choice, you know. I can either take the army I have now and do something with it, or I can just wait, build it up. But building all that is just gonna take forever and ever. Hmm. Why do you need a citadel? Citadel is so expensive. Oh, and I probably should be using caravans to move around as well. Let's do the Unicorn Glades. Even though they don't go together with this, it's easier to get them. Okay, next. 
I don't know how far we are uh, in the recording. I assume we are a decent chunk in already. There's a lot of them here. That's fine. Okay. Let me... Let me just uh, build the unicorn glades. Because I already decided I want to do them. Now we have no money again. And uh, I need to somehow go through first. So... This is the only place I need to visit right now, isn't it? We have visited that one, yes. We have visited uh, this one, yes. This one was visited, visited. I don't know if I need all those things there. I could go for the gold mine, probably should have done it earlier. Yeah. Okay. Let's go around. After we pick up uh, the power-ups, we'll call it the day. So caravans are most likely needed. Yeah, caravans are definitely needed. And 4,000, yeah. Okay. Next. There's nothing else here. Go this way. I could also be, like, killing a few of them. Can I get some levels here? 4,000. I could get some levels. You know. Another caravan. And let's see. Grandmaster pathfinding, that's fine. And uh, the other one will give me seamanship. I don't know if I want to... Scouting, pathfinding, stealth. Maybe if I don't take seamanship, they will, the game will not offer me seamanship anymore. Which I would definitely appreciate. I would definitely appreciate, so let's try not to take the seamanship. And we have Grandmaster everything here. Need to go a little bit more with the combat. Okay, I do not have any, any big army. And that means I will not be able to go after them or anything else, to be honest. So yeah, I need to return, take the army, and then then do some some other stuff. Look at how far she can go. That Grandmaster Pathfinding probably gave her a lot of uh, additional movement points. Looks like it, at least. Two taverns. Yeah, let's do two taverns, just in case. Next turn. And uh, come back. And uh, now we have five of these guys. We can recruit one. Okay, so we need we need a lot of money, but maybe I can now exchange. I probably should have tried to exchange in the trading post. Huh. You think so? Let's have a look. Save as... Uh, Fight number two, and let's uh, have a quick look. What's the trading? Uh, 83. Okay. And if I go here. Um. Whatever. If I go here, it's 125. That's a lot better. That's a lot better. 
Hmm. So do I go back and exchange? Because I'm not going to spend this uh, all otherwise. I do want that money. How much will it be? Uh, that's like 60, 100, 130, 150, 150 times, uh, or, or let's say 100 times, 125, that's 10,000. Oh, that's like nothing. Mm. Okay, then I guess we wait. I guess we wait. In any case, uh, let's uh, save it here as end of episode 21. And when we come back, uh, we'll try to level up a little bit more. Now doing fights with the birds and everything else as well. And after that, we'll try to break into the enemy territory as well and, and see what's going to happen. Twin Pines is the town we need to get and it has scores company, band, dozens, dozens company. So it's, a, it's decently protected, I would say. Lord Darnham, can't see which level, but probably a high level anyway. Uh, we need to still reach seven more levels and we will definitely try to do that here. No reason not to before we go after them. So yeah, a full, full episode, I guess, will be needed. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Bye-bye. <laughs>